babes, what is up guys? Welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I made a very low-key, very simple makeup look. <laughs> for you to wear, you know, just lounging around the house, or if you know you want to go to your friend's house for Valentine's Day, or even just wear to school. It's very uh, nice and uh, natural looking. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> so today I did, um, I took Valentine's Day makeup and I, uh, gave it crack and made this. <laughs> I have been not doing any, like, artistic makeup for so long, like a month. I know, that may not seem like a while, but for me, it's a fat minute. So, um, yeah, I decided to just full on go crazy. I decided to do a little heart here, which I thought was super cute and fun. I don't know, I like it. And then I wrote the word love, which this was actually not that hard to do, surprisingly. Um, yeah, I was worried about that. I was like, oh my gosh, I have to write it backwards. I just realized that. And it actually was pretty easy, so yeah. So I am really excited for this look. And I honestly, like, am super proud of it. I hope you guys enjoyed it. So if you guys would like to learn how to do this really over the top, extra dramatic, like my soul and personality look, then just keep on watching. Okay, beauty babes, the first thing I'm doing is pulling out my Too Faced Natural Lust bronzer and just doing my bronzer, obviously. And now we're moving on to our eyes, so I'm just going to be pulling out my Morphe 39S Such a Gem Palette. This palette is, like, so gorgeous for Valentine's Day because it's, like, got all these, like, nice colors. I haven't even used so many of these colors, guys. Like, this is insane. First, I'm going to be going into the color Super Swanky and just putting that on my crease. Now, I'm just pulling out my Too Faced Pulling This Way concealer, and I'm just going to be making, like, a spoon shape. I've done this before whenever you do it. Like, we're basically kind of in a way going to be doing a double cut crease. The best advice I could give you is to put it on and then lift your eye up so that you can find your crease line and then make a spoon shape off of that. Now I'm just going to be going into the color Strike Up Pose and I'm just going to be putting this on the outer corner of my double cut crease. And I'm going to be like drawing a line up here because again we're going to be connecting all of this together so it's not going to be like a regular du um, double cut crease because we're not going to be doing any eyeliner or anything like that. We're just going to have them connect. And by eyeliner I mean like a wing. Now I'm going into the color Oh Yas and putting this in the center of my eye, building off of the color Strike a Pose. And we will be doing one more color after this, so make sure to leave blue. And finally, I'm going into the color Here For It and just putting this on the inner corner of my eyelid. Now I'm pulling out my Too Faced Too Fruity Long Lasting Eyeshadow in the color Strawberries and Champagne. And I'm just going to be doing my eyeliner kind of with this. I'm going to be making it very thick though because we are going to be adding eyeliner on regular. So make sure to make it thick so that you can actually see it with the other eyeliner on. We're going to the color Decadent AF and I'm just going to be putting this outlining the double cut crease we just did. And I like to do this now because we already added all the colors in so that way you don't have to like go over it again or anything like that. Like it'll stay like this. So I'm just going to kind of give it a little bit of a shadow. And we are actually not putting anything on our brow bone because we are going to be doing something there. So just a heads up, guys. Okay, now we're going to be getting on to our under eyes. And I'm just going to be going into the color Strike a Pose and putting that halfway underneath my eye. Now I'm pulling back out my Too Faced Tutti Frutti Liquid Eyeshadow in the color Strawberries and Champagne. I don't know why, but I just love that name. I don't know why, though. And I'm just going to be putting this the rest of the way underneath my eye. And now I'm just pulling out my NYX Professionals eye pencil in the color, I think white blank is this? White blank, yeah. I'm just gonna putting this on my waterline. And now it is time for eyeliner, so I'm pulling out my NYX Professionals, that is the point eyeliner in the color Hella Fine, and I'm just gonna be doing my eyeliner no wing, just doing regular eyeliner for the lash. If you're not wearing fake eyelashes and you're just wearing mascara, you really don't have to do this. But I just like to do it because it looks really bad if you put lashes on without eyeliner. 
Now I'm pulling out my NYX Professionals Liquid Eyeliner in the color White Blank. And I am just going to be doing, I'm not drawing a wing, but I am, I'm going to be drawing my double cut crease and then meeting a line halfway. Just if you're confused, just watch me do it. I suck at explaining things. I'm sorry guys, I really suck. And now that I have this part done, I'm just going to be drawing another line and connecting the two of them together. So I think I'm going to add like a little heart in between the two. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to start drawing my heart. I did not say that correctly. Now I'm going back into my Too Faced Tutti Fruity Liquefied Eyeshadow in the color Strawberry and Champagne. That is, yep, that is the name of it. I got the name right. And I'm just putting this inside the heart. Okay, so now here's my personal favorite part. I was thinking, Allison, what could make this even more dramatic? Because why the hell not? And I decided let's write love underneath our eyebrows. So we're gonna do that. I feel like it'll be pretty easy, especially if I was able to do a heart. We're gonna do a heart now. You know, if you have like a festival or something to go to, I've got you covered. See, look at it needed it. It really did. I should put more of that pink stuff in the heart again because that's adorable. I missed makeup so much from my uh, month break that I have not done anything like crazy and artistic yet, so this is what I'm taking it out of. So, okay, I found these silver sparkles. Okay, yeah, so I think I'm gonna just put some sparkles like underneath my eye. Oh my gosh, yeah. So there's like ones that are big, like they're like medium sized and they're small ones. I think I'm gonna do something like that. Now I'm pulling out my Too Faced Tutti Fruity Liquefied Eyeshadow in the color Guava Glitz, and I'm just gonna be putting this on the inner corner of my eyelid. Okay guys, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go and do the other eye off camera and then we'll move on with everything else. Okay, baby babe, so I finished both of my eyes and I popped on some lovely lashes. And so while we are waiting for my lash glue to dry, we are moving on to highlighter. Now I'm pulling out my Becca highlighter in the color Prismatic Amethyst. And I actually just got this um, from Sephora. You know what that feeling when you just get a good highlighter and you like, are like crying inside because it's like so beautiful and shiny, oh my god. Now I'm pulling out my Tarte Nine Ways to Shine Cheek Wardrobes and I'm just using the rose gold one which has the colors Snow Kissed, Prize, and Permit Mocha and I'm just using the blush which is called Prize. Now I'm just pulling out my Better Than Sex Mascara and I'm just gonna obviously be doing my mascara. So now we're gonna get on to lipstick and I'm pulling out my What A Shock Too Faced Melted Matte Liquefied Lipstick in the color Melted Clover. This is actually a limited edition one, but any pink lipstick will obviously do. Okay, beauty babes, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Please like, share, and subscribe. Comment down below if you have any hit requests or a new press or sleeve press or anything like that. Now I'll try my hardest to do them. If you'd like to follow me on my social media, if you'd like to do that right over here, and it will also be linked down below, along with my last video, which is playing underneath me right now. You guys definitely check that out. If you'd like to subscribe to my channel, it is obviously the subscribe button down below. And make sure you hit the bell icon so you get notified whenever I upload any new videos. Okay, I think that is all I have to say. Bye-bye, beauty babes. Love you. Happy Valentine's Day.